Welcome everybody. Just finished getting on this pontoon because you know from here we have access directly to the ocean with no bridges. So we were just had a pontoon day with a suit on. Yeah, that makes sense. Right behind me is a $4,990,000 Coconut Grove waterfront estate with four stories that makes you feel like you're literally on a cruise ship. And you're in Coconut Grove next to Kennedy Park and the ocean not too far. Without further ado, let's go and check out this beauty, shall we? Let me go inside now. <laughs> Welcome everybody. So we just got off of the pontoon and now we're gonna show you this beautiful estate right behind us. It is so unique, it's very art deco and when you're inside, it feels like you're on a cruise ship like I mentioned before. But if you notice the front here, you have your driveway along over here with a one and a half car garage there, right? Where you could put a car and maybe some bicycles and storage, right? It wouldn't fit two cars though, but it's nice to have a garage and this driveway space, right? Not this right here next to us, but right next to that house is Kennedy Park, where you have AC's Ices. AC's Ices is incredible. You could have that every single day for the rest of your life if you live here. I don't know if you want to do, you probably get tired of it eventually. Anyways, before we get inside, let's just show you the outside over here. So you have just over 7,000 square feet of land. So to the left of the entry, you have this yard space over here. It's a good sized yard. If you wanted to put a pool, you could possibly do that right over here. But why, why put a pool when you have waterfront living? <laughs> we'll get to that in a second. Staircase over there, at least to the second floor. As you see, it's a four story home and it is spectacular inside. Completely gut renovated with the finest, the finest, with the Midas touch. Who says that? Who says the Midas touch? I don't even know. Anyways, who says it? Somebody says it. All right, let's go. So you walk in to the foyer entry over here. It's a large foyer entry, as you can see. You have the table here. You could even put some more seating here if you wanted. Right back here, under the staircase, you have a half bath. It's a powder room here. And then right over here is the access to the one car garage. All right, then down over here, this is where you're gonna have access to that pontoon live in, or the boat living, or the jet ski living, whatever, whatever it is you prefer. They say you could have up to 35 foot boat there, uh, but a pontoon, those things are so much fun. I've, I love them, I love them. So room over here, this is like another little family room to just kind of hang out and enjoy that water view right here next to us. And you get to see the manatees. You can actually see a manatee right here. Uh, the manatees are always here, which is so, so nice. There's like the mom and like the, 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 the little one right next to it all the time. It's beautiful, love to see that, love to see it. Um, over here you have a closet in this room and then you have a little bar area here with a refrigerator and more storage space. So that way you can have some drinks and stuff down here while watching the game or hanging out and enjoying the view. And this is obviously your access to the boat as well, if you have a boat or a pontoon, and you have direct access to the ocean with no bridges. What? So now we work our way upstairs so we can show you the living space where you're gonna spend most of your time. Let's go. upstairs to the second floor. This is where the entertaining, the fun happens. You notice you have this bar right over here. Look at this, I actually, I love this. So you're coming up the stairs and you're already starting to get a glimpse of that bar. And the bar is right off of the family room right over here with a massive cloud couch. I wanna jump on it, but Jill told me not to jump on it, so I'm not jumping on it. We can't touch that couch, it's just too nice. All right, family room here to entertain, watch the game, have some fun. And then over here, you have the balcony, which is real neat. Balcony over here, faces a quiet, quieter street on this side and your, your, um, your yard space here down below. And this is the staircase that goes down. And then you have the view once again of the water and you get a glimpse of Kennedy Park. Very nice area to lounge, hang out but we can lounge and hang out in here too, right? So you're getting a nice view of this entire space. Again, family room, the bar, dining room over here, 
overlooking with the windows, looking at the front of the house, the attention to detail, I mean, the light fixtures from restoration hardware, I, everything is just so warm and inviting. And then you have your staircase that goes up to the third floor, which we'll show you after. And then here you have your kitchen with the black quartz countertops, nice white cabinetry. And then over here, you got a little TV, little TV in the wall. You have another half bath right over here, powder room. And then over here, you have your laundry room to get that clothes clean. Best part, you know what we like? When we have a sink with a view, this one you just gotta go and you're looking right at that water view where your boat would go straight out to the ocean. And you see a little glimpse once again of Kennedy Park. So this is the space where you're gonna spend most of your time. People are gonna be over drinking, socializing up here. But where do you sleep? Where do the people sleep that live in this house? They sleep right on up. Let's go to the third floor, shall we? But on our way to the third floor, I wanted to point out what you probably saw in the first staircase when we're going up, all of the staircases have this glass block that gives it that art deco feel. It keeps that nice, unique vibe going on, which I love. It, it, bringing in and blending different characteristics from different times is so, so nice. The flooring throughout, as you'll notice, is a porcelain tile flooring. And it's nice because it looks like an oak wood, it looks like wood, but it's porcelain, so it's super, super easy to maintain. This is the third floor. You have this little foyer hangout area. You could even put like a little couch, you know, a little love seat or something. And if you wanted to put a TV, I guess you could. You could figure out a space for it. But this is just a little seating area here. And then you have two bedrooms off of this area, right? So this is the first bedroom over here. All the bedrooms, there's three of them in total. Every single one of them has its own bathroom. This is one of my favorite rooms because it feels like you're on a cruise ship. Look at the windows. The windows literally make it feel like you're on a boat. I'm on a boat, I'm on a boat. You know, you could actually sing that song in this house. Bathroom over here, very nice. Again, warm and inviting um, attention to detail that they put throughout the entire place, which is very nice. Super cozy. And then you have two closets that are built out right over there. And then over here, we're back onto the, you know, foyer area. And then you have your other bedroom over here that faces the water view back over here. And you have a good size room too. That looks like a king size bed to me with the two nightstands. You got the closets over here. And then you have your own bathroom here as well. Everybody's got their bathroom. No need to share. Now, we work our way upstairs and we check out the impressive primary suite where you will spend a third of your life. A third, let's go. Check this out. You have the entire fourth floor of this residence to yourself. Literally the entire floor with some of the best views. You are high up in the sky. So over here you have your actual bedroom, king size bed, two nightstands, beautiful light fixture there, little seating area here, TV on the wall. Bar right over here so you don't have to go down and up the stairs. They thought that through. You have your bar, Fiji water, or Perrier, whichever one you prefer. <laughs> and then I'm gonna show you, before we go to the bathroom, because the bathroom has some of the best views you'll ever see, I wanna show you this massive terrace. They have a really large, entertaining space up here. But of course, on the fourth floor, so why would you entertain? I'm saying you entertain with you and your significant other. This is where you guys chill out. You talk about your day, you relax, you smell the ocean and you see the ocean right over here. So if you get a little sliver view, looking right over all of these houses, you see the ocean straight ahead. I'm not sure if you see that, but just having the ocean so close and having that breeze, there's nothing like it, right? So this is a really cool area for you to hang out and entertain with your significant other, get some drinks, get some wine, put it in, back in the refrigerator if you want, whatever. These are the uh, opening or rather impact doors that open up. And then we're back into the bedroom, bar over here once again, and then you have the bathroom. This bathroom is my favorite for a few reasons, which you'll see now. So the, the, the finishes, first off, love it. Very warm colors as we've seen throughout, right? You have a walk-in closet over here with the matching cabinetry from the, 
right here. It's all matching, it's great. I love it. Big closet too, actually very big. And then you have your tub right over here. And then again, more storage space here. Oh, this is for your laundry. Look at that, they thought it through. But best part, right over here, you have the mirror, which reflects a view of Kennedy Park and the view of the ocean. So again, you see over the buildings, but here's a little bit clearer where you see out, and I actually see three sailboats right now out there in the ocean. That is amazing. Like, I know it's not a full ocean view, but it's a view of the water of the ocean from your master bathroom. And then another favorite part of this bathroom up here is the shower with the circular window over here. When you're looking out this window, like, come here. You have to come here. You have to come, let's, this is not weird. We're, I know we're in the shower together, but don't get weird at out by it. <laughs> uh, George laughed, when George laughs, you know it's funny. So, circular window here, and you're looking out to the park. That's Kennedy Park right there. That's one of the best parks in the area. So peaceful, great to walk your dog, great to even go and enjoy the water views too. It's very nice, and you get to see it right from your shower. So you're dancing. Dancing in the mirror, singing in the shower, with a view of Kennedy Park. Yeah, and then you look at the ocean. What? All right, that's, that's enough of that. Um, and then, of course, you're wondering where the toilet room is. The toilet room is right down there in that bath, in that, well, that bathroom, that door, behind this door, which is where you have the toilet. But that's basically the end of the tour, right? Uh, $4,990,000 in Coconut Grove, waterfront, just over 7,000 square foot land, and just over 3,200 square feet of living space, four stories, completely got renovated. The list goes on and on, and this could be yours. Make sure you go down, you like, subscribe, and you comment. If you have any questions about this property, shoot me an email, youtube at jonathanvegagroup.com, or, you know what, just go down and subscribe too. Peace and love, thanks for watching. much to Jill Patterson with Gary Hennis Realtors for allowing us to tour this spectacular Coconut Grove estate. Without her, we wouldn't be here right now. So thank you so much, Jill. Now go, now go like and subscribe. See you in the next video.